Joining are a pair of fashion industry legends. She is the editor in chief of the fashion world's Bible, Vogue magazine, and he was the only designer among Time magazine's 100 most influential for 2010. Please welcome Anna Wintour and Mark Jacobs. <laughs> Yeah, you'll be shouting, shouting a chair this evening. Yes, welcome, welcome to the show. Thank, Thank you. you. I'm so happy to have uh, you on the show. I've known you guys for a while. Uh, no, I think I've known you longer uh, from the Met Ball. That's right. That's yes. right. You always invite me. You have this amazing uh, night out, uh, the Met Ball. At the, it's a fundraiser. Yes, it raises money for the Metropolitan Museum's Costume Institute every year. And I was actually lucky enough two years ago to have Mark as my co-chair. I think you were there that night. Absolutely. In the receiving line with Justin Timberlake and uh, Kate hey. Moss. Yeah. It's always fun uh, to, for me to, to drink in a museum legally. That's yeah. always what I like yes. about that. But it, it is. They still it, let you drink. <laughs> Smoking is another issue. Yeah, yeah no. legally in the bathroom. I do exactly. love that, though. It is so much fun. It's very. I, you know, one of the reasons I love it because you know how to throw a party. I mean, it's so well organized. You get in there. Everyone's dressed up. It's it's the the, the biggest of the bigs in, in fashion, and everyone's got these beautiful gowns, and everyone's dressed so nice. You get in. You you, you do have a few drinks, but it's always fun. And then a crazy, awesome. Uh, performance by something. Yes. Well, we had uh, a Lady Gaga this this year. Yeah. You were there, that right? Was fantastic. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there was a brief moment where she um, was communing with God and she was praying, <laughs> praying in in the back, waiting for God to tell her it was all right to go uh, actually on stage. And yeah, yeah. <laughs> as one does. Yeah, as one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I always talk to God too. Whenever He says you can start the show, like he's, He books a lot of acts in New well, York City. <laughs> Fortunately, he gave her the message after 45 minutes. So. <laughs> That's right. That was very interesting. I do like to the mix of people. Yes. Like it's very interesting. Like you do that so well too. I, you, it's, a, it's anywhere from comedians to, you know, Mick Jagger. I sat with Mick this year, and then right. sometimes I sat with you know Tom Ford or right. you know or Mark. If I'm right. lucky to, 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 to sit with you. <laughs> yeah, you'll never have me. Yet. You won't let me sit with you. Why? Yeah, I don't know. I just I'm picky about who I sit with. <laughs> Unbelievable. And what do you have on? You're wearing something interesting. A uh, kilt. You're wearing a kilt? A sort of kilt, yeah. It's like a, a pseudo kilt. It's a kilt, half kilt. Yeah. A kilt, half kilt. A half I've kilt. never seen that. It's not quite a banana outfit. But... <laughs> no, no. about the banana boys. Yeah, you were going to come out dressed as bananas. We were worried. <laughs> no, no, we don't make everyone do that. I was particularly worried. <laughs> no, I, I wasn't. I, I wouldn't make like you guys it. do that. Uh, now, uh, Anna, I would say that you are the editor in chief of this. This is your day job, right. Vogue magazine. Right. <laughs> See how thick this is. This is 726 pages in one magazine. This is like, it weighs, it weighs, it, how much is this? It's, it's $4.99. It weighs six pounds. It weighs more than per dollar. Right. You're getting more for your buck. Right. This is amazing. Well, there's a great picture of Mark in there, actually. Are you wearing a kilt there? Yes. yes. <laughs> Are you really? And my arm is in a sling. Yeah, it was a really good day for me. Right. Was, that for, <laughs> was that for a photo shoot or you just hurt your arm? No, I just had my shoulder operated on. But unfortunately, one can, or fortunately, one can't say no to Anna. So when I was asked to be in the picture, I was like, okay, I'll leave the hospital, get off the morphine drip, and go to the photo shoot. <laughs> oh, my God. What a great picture, but yeah. It, it was a portfolio uh, celebrating Fashions Night Out, which uh, is yes. happening uh, uh, next week, believe it or not, yes. and Mark is obviously going to be doing wonderful things. I think you're going to be there at I your am store. Going to be there at your nice store. suit, by the way. Yes. Thank you. I am wearing Mark Jacobs. Yes. You know how to do Thank it, buddy. <laughs> I'm very smart. I think. Yeah, I think ahead. I knew yes. you, oh, you make great stuff. Amazing stuff. Thank you. When did you realize, like, as a, as a designer? I mean, you're just coming up and you go, you, you go. I mean, it's a tough job. I mean, yeah. not everyone's immediately successful. When did you realize I made it? Um, I think, well, actually, about 12 years ago, I got a job working with Vuitton. My partner and I had started Marc Jacobs years ago. And when we, when we were approached by Louis Vuitton, which is a company some people out there might have heard of, um, uh, I think things really took off for us because we started opening shops. I mean, Anna, of course, was really super supportive of us, back from her HG house and garden days, and even before. And uh, that, that helped. But, but when, when it felt like a real success is when we started opening our own boutiques, we started reaching more people by designing accessories like bags and shoes. We got our name out there. And then we started doing a lower price line, which got it out to even more people. And, of course, that's, I guess, what made us a success. A success. Do you think, uh, like, a celebrity wears your stuff? Is that, like, a big break for you? Like, if somebody's like, oh, my gosh, 
Sophia Coppola is wearing my bag. Yeah. Is that a well, giant thing? Sophia is a friend. Um, yeah. yeah, she. I guess she is. A, yeah, big celebrity. But um, but um, uh, or Sarah it, Jessica it, Parker it or something it's, like. Oh yeah, my gosh. it doesn't hurt. I mean, you know, um, I think everybody out there in the world is so keen on like celebrity and what people are doing and wearing, and and their their general interest in fashion that 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 certainly is a great promotion. But um, but we don't really court them. You know, it's just like if you come and you want it, it's cool and. Did you ever think you'd make it to this height? I mean, you're really, no. I mean, you, you, you're making baby clothes now? No, I know. I never, never thought I would. No. It's exciting. Yeah, it's great. It's fascinating. I'm grateful, happy. Now, Anna, do you, I was going to ask you, like, when you, because you've broken so many designers, that must feel good, right? Well, it's one of the... <laughs> in a good way. In, in a good broken way. I mean, not broken. You've broken choose... You've crushed their dreams. That's... You've crushed the dreams of designers everywhere. That's not the word that I would have chosen. But obviously, it's, it's one of the, the great joys of this job that you are able to help people uh, along the path. And um, it's really wonderful when you see someone like Mark, whom I've known for so many years and, and seen him struggle in the early days and become such a success and I think such an inspiration to so many young designers all over the world. So, so I think like, yeah, if, as a designer, if you get a spread in, in Vogue magazine, that's like being a comedian and getting on Johnny Carson. You go, oh my gosh, that's it? I've reached the, the, the my career's right. set? I remember my first cover, you put, it was Michaela, an Israeli model, and you put her in a yellow and white dress of mine. It was that's back right. in the days of Perry Ellis. And I was on the subway going to work. And someone said to me, you've got a dress on the cover of Vogue. What are you doing on the subway? <laughs> <laughs> they wanted you to take a horse like, and carriage. Well. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but I think we're meant to talk about Fashion Night Out. Yes, we will go back to talk about Fashion Night, <laughs> absolutely. Because it is, uh, explain how big it is now. Because this is the second year you're doing this? It is the second year. And, and we started it about 18 months ago when everybody was really in the retail doldrums. And the idea was just to uh, really have the world become inspired by fashion again and understand how much fun it was to get them back into the stores and make designers and celebrities and models available to them in a way that you know not 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 it's not usually possible yeah and you like so on friday night is next friday right you the yes. stores stay open later than normal yes and you yes. have like sales and no sales. No. Full price. Things are for sale. They're it's not on sale. sale. No yes. discounts? Come on, I know Maybe you guys. For you. Come on, Maybe please, come for on. You. Uh, no, but you want everyone, and it's, uh, it's spread everywhere. Is it it's just like, your, is it boutique stores or is it everything? It's like, no, it's, uh, it's uh, boutiques, department stores, specialty stores. It's, new, you know, the U.S., Europe. It's, it's, yeah, it's, it's a it's thousand, a big... I think a thousand um, stores in New York, a hundred cities across America, and 16, 17, 18 countries now. Wow. So uh, all over the world will be shopping like crazy on the 10th. Yeah, but I think, is, you know, yeah. what's really fun is it's, it's being able to meet the people that you don't usually meet all on the same night and do fun things like, I think, at Barney's you can play ping pong or they're doing musical chairs. And I don't know what, maybe you two are going to dress as bananas and <laughs> yeah. throw water. I'm, I'm wearing my kilt that's not a I kilt. Do whatever they tell me at the office. Yeah. <laughs> okay. well, be, but also next week is going to be crazy for you guys because Tuesday night you're doing like the biggest the largest fashion show in New York City. That's right, that's yeah. right. Well, it's yeah. a consumer fashion show. It's really the kickoff to Fashion's Night Out. Uh, it's open to the public, although unfortunately we've all, we sold out within an hour. It's uh, 200 models, the trends of the whole full season. And we're just, uh, my biggest nightmare is that it's not going to start on time. Because for many years I've always complained about people not starting on time. And I'm yeah, worried that of, I'll do the same thing. You're kind of famous for not starting on time. I not was. Anymore. Not anymore. I was famous for starting later than anybody in the United States of America. <laughs> and then I changed. Well, what was and that? now I start. And the only person who's actually seen the show is Anna because everybody else had been locked out. We started, like, in advance. You started early. <laughs> you started early this yeah, year? I tend to be very extreme that way, either three hours late or ten minutes early. But, but it's can, always worth it. Can you tell us what your fall lineup is going to be, what your fall line is? Oh, fall line's done, thank God. Uh, spring, I have no idea. We've got, like, ten days left, and a lot can change in ten days. So it can go from floor-length dresses to, you know, micro mini skirts over the next week. What is, what is the new black? Uh, Forty-seven. <laughs> 47. There you go. There's my a curveball for you. Yes. I don't know what that, for 47, I don't know what that means. Is that a type my of, age? You're, it's your age. Yeah, it was yeah, a so joke. you're the new a black. Bad no, joke. no, 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 please. But I, mean, I was expecting like, like top or pink. Pink is, is pink the new, the new black. black? 
No, no it's pink not. Pink is the navy blue of India. That was Diana <laughs> Bruno. <laughs> you're you're blowing my, my mind right now. This is fantastic. Well, fashion. anyways, Fashion Night Out is next Friday. I will be out with you guys celebrating. Come shop, everybody. Come please. shop, everybody. You're doing a great thing. Thank you for doing that. Please come back from everyone. Please. I appreciate it. Fashion Night Out is September 10th. Our thanks to Anna Wintour and Mark Jacobs. Amazing.